Um, I guess we're ready to start? There's serious dueling to be done. A deadly duel. I hope we can teach you a thing or two. I'm more of an immaterial girl myself, and I'm ready for some excitement. I'm gonna bury you. We really have a lot to teach each other, don't we? What's up, team? And thank you for checking in on us. Today, we are going to be continuing our housing gauntlet farming series. Today's episode will be the Spiral Cup Gauntlet. And today, our carry that we have with us is Aaliyah Dark Dreamer. She is a, let's see, I think she's one, yeah, one, I was going to say 140, so with my apologies <laughs> for, for sliding her. So she's a 143 myth. So uh, she will be our carry here. So yeah, this is uh, tier one of the Spiral Cup Gauntlet. Uh, some things to know about it. I believe that it was released in 2014. Um, it is Wisteria based. I, I kind of like the dialogue, the story through here. It's not your normal, well, I won't spoil it. You'll hear some of it, or you've already heard some of it, but it's a different different type of story. It's a different type of gauntlet as far from a story standpoint. Now, there are six battles in here. There's two bosses, and the drops that we look for, I guess probably the highlights, what you're really looking for is the energy gear out of here. Now, there's not much that drops on Tier 1, but uh, there is some, and I mentioned there are six fights. Now you can get gear from virtually all the fights. Uh, you, again, I said two bosses, and uh, the rest are elites. But even the elites, you can get some gear. Now again, I, I think there's just a piece or two of actual energy gear that drops in here for tier one. Uh, but you can get, well, actually, oh, uh, Oh boy, his hat that he's got came from here. Uh, I guess I guess I ran him through here moons ago. I don't even remember it, but that is a there is some stitchable gear. I mean, that's all it is. There's no stats with them, but uh, that is kind of the style of that hat there. So, yeah, I guess that's about all I can babble about. Uh, the Green Warden gear. There's you know there's different types. Um, I think it's called Green Warden Energetic. I believe that's the one with the energy. Uh, also, though, uh, Pink Dandelions. If you're a seafall connoisseur, you know those pe uh, pink dandelions are they're very, <laughs> very needed. So they drop in uh, several, uh, and possibly all the fights. Uh, you can get uh, pink dandelions, so that's that's good as well. So let's go ahead. And Stop jabbering, and let's hop on in here and get this thing going. Moving right along, and Chamber of the Hydra is first. to note on that one. Nope, nope. Just normal, you know, bag fillers, backpack <laughs> space killers. Uh, the other cool thing about this place is the, gosh, the mana and the health that float around here. You don't have to worry about healing much. Well, you know, tier one, you don't have to worry that much at all. So, uh, here we're going. Uh, Hall of the Spectre. Let's go inspect the specter. Well, I, 
I don't mind, you know, Dragon Blade, those type of treasure cards, I don't mind. Nothing else to write home about, though. Next is Hall of the Harpy. Librarian. We're off to the Basilisk. Basilisk. of interest over there. Junk, 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 junk. Backpack filler, backpack filler. Oh dear, here we go. Those guys should have been right here. Check out what I spy with my I, I tell you, when you guys roll through here, if you haven't actually run this yet or before, the these these guys are a hoot to listen to what they've done. It's it's pretty good. All right, got my carry in here. Let's do this. similar to those elites. And hey, we got to go first this time. Run for that. I don't 
see any. Um, but, um, you know. So, yeah. That finishes us up here with Tier 1 of the Spiral Cup Gauntlet. We did end up pulling a 50% go first um, rate. But other than what? Uh, Dragon Blade treasure cards? That was probably the best. I don't think. Uh, see, I don't see any pets or much of anything. But I, from what I hear and read of other people's opinions and such, this is not one of the more popular dungeons to farm. Now again, the you, you'll see the Green Warden crew running around the spiral. You know that tree-looking outfit, and that's that's pretty good energy gear, especially if you don't have to buy a pack for it. And, you know, buy this bundle. Well, shoot. Yeah, well, I'm going to hold off on that. <laughs> but anyway, if you get the bundle that this dungeon's included in, or this gauntlet's included in, obviously you can run it, run it until you get the whole set. But uh, anyway, that uh, wraps up run number one. So let's go ahead and move along to the next one.